Essex police have referred themselves to the IOPC following an incident in which a man was tasered and subsequently died. Police were called to an address in Clockhouse Way in Braintree on Monday the 21st of November at around 20 past 11 in the morning. Apparently while police were talking to neighbours trying to establish what had happened, they were confronted by a man and a taser was deployed. Now there's currently no mention what the man did to deserve being zapped other than the police were confronted by him, but the taser was deployed. The man was then reported to have been taken unwell and died at the scene despite efforts from emergency services. A spokesman for Essex Police said officers were called to reports of a disturbance at Clockhouse Way, Braintree, at around 11.20am on Monday, November the 21st. They responded quickly and spoke with people on their arrival to establish the cause of the disturbance and to protect those present. During their engagement with a man at the location they had been called to in Clockhouse Way, a taser was deployed. The man was reported to have been taken unwell. Despite the work of an ambulance crew and police officers, the man was sadly pronounced dead at the scene shortly after 1pm. We have made a mandatory referral to the independent office for police conduct as is appropriate in all such cases and the IOPC has confirmed that it would investigate the incident. So yet again another death by taser. I know the police don't really care and are very happy to zap people because they have it drummed into them through training that the tasers are safe. But the number of people who have died by taser is steadily rising and someone out there needs to look into this and actually do something about it. Tasers are for the use of or in life or death situations only. They're not a way of stopping a suspect from running away. They're not a way of getting someone to comply because they're being a bit confrontational or obstructive. That's what de-escalation training is for, your ability to connect with people, show empathy and problem solve. If a copper needs to deploy a taser for anything other than a life or death situation, then they shouldn't be in the police.